All right, guys, you already know it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. Listen, I just left from work right now, man. It's a long ass day. I don't know if you guys could actually see me or not. I think this is kind of dangerous because I don't have a tripod and I'm holding this with my own hands. And <laughs> I don't know if this is actually safe. Well, I'm gonna do a little vlog for you guys. You know, pretty much what I've been up to. Something that you guys didn't know was, you know, like um, last December, my sister, well, not last December, this December that just passed, December 27th, uh, my sister passed away. And that's one of the reasons why I actually started you know, vlogging and creating videos for you guys more and more often. Like, I'll be honest with you guys, like, I was like pretty depressed the past few days because today marks one month that my sister passed away. You know, like, like my sister was like my twin. Like, I, I don't even know how to explain it because she was like such an amazing person and like she's been through so much the past few years that you know it really I didn't know how much it affected me till yesterday when like literally I was just you know I noticed like hey I'm not making no videos and like I'm not recording like I don't know why when I really most of these days I've been recording every single day as you guys can see and then out of nowhere, like, I, I just didn't have no more energy to record anything, make any videos, or say anything. I was just feeling kind of depressed, and then I'm like, yeah, like, my sister just passed away. I haven't really been able to grieve because I've had to be stronger than than anybody from my, my family. Like, my mom has been devastated, and I've been just, you know, I've, I've put on this face of being happy all the time but it's like somehow it just caught up to me so yesterday I'm over here driving and I'm like what the hell I'm like just like I don't know I just started crying like I don't care to say hey I, yeah I cried but my sister died you know like she was only 27 years old I'm 29 and like I don't even know how I'm gonna continue life with without my sister and like gonna have a kid and she was like so excited to see see my son and be a part of his life and like she was like so happy for us for me and my girlfriend and like now I don't even know what I'm gonna do you know like I'm moving into this new house with me and my girlfriend and my mother is actually moving in with us and you know it's just it's just crazy like, right now I'm over here. <laughs> I'm driving. Driving home, guys. I know this This video is not, it's not about, uh, you know, about code. It's not about programming. But at the same time, I kind of want to do videos like this where I'm speaking from the heart and letting you guys know what's going on with me. Like, you know not doing it daily because I, I can't imagine myself doing daily vlogs and sharing every single piece of, of my life with you guys but at least you you know keep you updated seeing what the hell I'm doing you know like why am I not posting anything like there was this guy who left a, a, a comment and it was like hey we fucking you know we miss your videos man where you at and pretty much that's that's what happened, you know. I was kind of depressed. Like today, I, I, I'm starting to feel better, you know. Like uh, people might ask, "Oh, what happened to your sister?" Well, diabetes killed my sister, and she didn't even know that she had diabetes. Like we know that uh, some some people of the family have it, but we, you know, I would have never thought that she was gonna die from diabetes or even myself if I have diabetes. I never thought of anything like that because nobody, I, we don't know nobody that has died from this thing. Like, it doesn't seem real. So yeah, so that's where, that's where I've been at. You know, 
It doesn't mean that I'm gonna stop making videos. I'm going to continue making videos. But it was just like, I don't know, I went through like a dark phase this, this past two, three days where I'm just like, I don't know, I was like depressed. Today I'm feeling better. Like I'm feeling, you know, more better about, you know, life. Like I'm gonna have a kid, I'm gonna get married, I'm gonna have my, my future wife in my house. Like we're gonna have a beautiful family. My mother's gonna move in with us, gonna help us out with a lot of stuff. You know, tomorrow I'm actually doing the whole move of the whole, you know, the whole move of the house and everything. And I'm like, you know, like I feel better now. Like, but, you know, I'm gonna tell you guys, like, please be careful if you have any type of history of diabetes. Like, take it serious. Like, just get yourself checked out, you know? Like, my sister was a, a, a beautiful person. And she has been through a lot the past few years. And for her to pass away from diabetes was like a something so, how you call it, like irresponsible. Like, you know, from all of us, you know, like I feel like we all have a part in this thing. Like there's a reason why she passed away. And I feel like she could have been safe if... She would have had taken care of herself, and if we would have taken care of her, or look after her, or like you know keep track of like whatever diabetes or her levels, because we didn't even know she had diabetes and she didn't know either. So that's another conversation because it's like we definitely looking into you know suing the hospital and suing everybody because. It's just not right. People pass away of diabetes, but when your own doctors tell you, hey, you're okay, and send you home, instead of checking your blood, and pretty much they would have noticed that her levels were pretty high. You know, that's like fucking negligence, man. You know what I mean? So, yeah, man. So I'm just keeping you guys updated. You know, keeping you guys updated on what, what I actually been up to and so I'm actually driving out here, man. This is what I'm doing for you guys. This is kind of dangerous. I don't got a tripod. I'm doing this thing straight off my head. So, you know, if it doesn't look right or it's off or whatever, like, just know I made this video out of my, you know, out of my heart and just to keep you guys updated. I was going to, you know, make a video tomorrow, but after seeing the comments and seeing people, you know, how much people miss me and miss my videos, I'm like, damn, I, I didn't know I had like an impact on people that they're actually waiting to see my videos. And you know what? I, I really appreciate that, guys, because tell you the truth, man, no amount of money, no amount of success, no amount of anything can be compared to, you know, what I feel for you guys right now. Like, oh, the answer, I mean. So make sure you subscribe and make sure you like this video, man. Um, <laughs> it's nothing educational. It was just a regular vlog, but, you know, just keeping you guys updated. Anyways, man, it's your boy Joe back at it again. Bye.